You may be seated. Hello, Your Honor. Hello. This is a case of Murphy versus Miles. Thank you, Jerome. Good day, everyone. Good day. Ms. Murphy, you claim you had a short, passionate relationship with the defendant, Mr. Miles, and then you became pregnant. Yes, Your Honor. Now you say he's married and wants to forget he has a three-year-old son. Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Miles, you argue that the only person you're trying to forget is Ms. Murphy. Yes, Your Honor. You deny paternity of her son and say her friends and family have told you another man is his biological father. Ms. Murphy, how has Mr. Miles participated in your son's life? Your Honor, this man has not done anything for my son. I can count on one hand how many times he's ever even came to visit his son. Aww. On top of that, he refers to my son as the boy. The boy. How's the boy doing? How's your son doing? What's his name again? Him and his daughter, they all look alike. They all have the same face, but he doesn't... He, he won't acknowledge that at all. What happened when you told him you were pregnant? He said, I don't want you to have this baby. This is not okay. I can't... I don't need this type of attention. I don't... He, di he didn't need it. You know, he was, he was man enough to make that baby, but he can't be man enough to take care of it. He has right. not done anything. This is exactly he wasn't what I told willing her. to pay for the paternity the, the paternity test and that's not any true. other way. He said he didn't have the money for it. If that's the case, Your Honor, we would not be here. It would already okay. be taken care of. So, sir, are these assertions true? What is going on with this situation? Well, Your Honor, first and foremost, um, I never said that. I didn't want to do things for him. I just was under the impression that it was not my son due to the fact of stuff that was told to me by family members. You know, she would tell me one minute she's pregnant by me, then she'd tell me, I asked her, what's the reason you got hickeys on your neck? And she tells oh my me... God. Really? And she, tell, and she tells me because really? um, the guy that's at, um, at her mom's complex pushed her up against the washing machine and put hickeys on her neck. Really? No, really? that didn't fly with me. Your Honor, that's a lie. I, when I was talking to him, I was only talking to him because I was so busy about how am I going to get back to his house? How am I going to get over there and see him? I really liked him at the time that we were seeing each other. I was not talking to anybody. All that he's saying is a lie. I've never so even had So, in your it. opinion, sir, what was the nature of the relationship with Ms. Murphy? Your Honor, um, to say it was a relationship, I couldn't say that. I could say it was more of we were cool, we were friends, you know. It was... I wouldn't say it was a relationship. Were you both committed to one another? I couldn't even say that, Your Honor. Were no. you aware um, whether or not she was sleeping with anybody else? Yeah, her family members told me specifically the family that, she that she was she were sleeping with. The family members told me oh. that she was getting around. The family members told me that she was getting around. The family See, members that Ms. he was sleeping um, with told Ms. him Murphy, that. Ms. Murphy, Ms. Murphy knew that I was already dealing with one of her family members. She knew that. Never did I. She knew that. So you were Never in a sexual I. relationship with a family member. Correct, and she knew that. Before Never knew. Your you Honor. two had a sexual relationship. Your Honor. Yes, and she was fully aware of and that. And what Your... did that person say specifically? She told me specifically, I don't know why you're dealing with Tanisha, um, well, Miss Murphy, because she gets around. And she's not the only person that told me that. I get friends around. Of, friends of hers have, have also told me that she gets around. But, Mr. And... Miles, do you think that and... information is credible, given the fact you were in a sexual relationship? relationship with that person? Um, well, not really. Um, yes and no, Your Honor. And what I mean by that is I try to give Miss Murphy the benefit of the doubt to not listen to what everybody else was telling me, but she pretty much painted the picture for herself on what she was about. Your that's Honor, me, Your so Honor, that's, 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 that's a Murphy, lie. I need, I need you to respond specifically okay. to these claims. But besides... The, okay, the, about the family part, he, I never knew that he was dealing with any of my family. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Were you dating, seeing Mr. Miles exclusively, or were you all in an open relationship? I never knew about it being an open relationship. This... He told me plenty of times that he loved me, you know, all this type of stuff. Um, I, I went over there pretty... Every, anytime I could. There's possibilities I could be the father. There's possibilities of not because the type of lifestyle that she carried around. Now, one thing about me... But one you, thing you about got me, around too, like, though. One thing about Every me... Every girl in Fresno knows Kiba, though. Okay. One thing about me, and a lot of the men know you, 
Okay. No, one they thing don't. About, no, yeah, they, they don't. Know, I've been with three people you. in Fresno. And that's not been true. Been with three people okay. in Fresno. One thing, one thing about you know. me, one thing you about know. me is, is all my children that I have, I have, I have a relationship with my children. This child, I don't even, I, I don't know if it's my child or not, because I know what type of woman I was dealing with. The type of stuff that you start doing, you let me see this stuff. You, she let me see this stuff what for herself. Stuff? Okay. She you don't got me, no okay. stuff. It's this, just the hickeys on her. The hickeys on her. Never neck. had hickeys yeah, before. Yeah, you did. yeah, okay. you did. Never had hickeys. Okay. The you, hickeys you, on her you neck. You gotta have another piece house. of evidence besides these hickeys. Okay, well, Thank so, you. Okay. so move my forward from that. This. My evidence is this. Okay, every male and female know what sex smells like. She came over to my house smelling like she had sex with somebody. You can tell she was potent. I'm just keeping I it real. I came over your house so, smelling like and, sex. And, and, and what let me know that she was getting around was the fact that every single time she was around my male relatives, she was always flirtatious, wearing skimpy stuff. Really? As a respect level, and you have somebody really? that you supposedly talk to. My mom to, wouldn't even buy those skimpy way, stuff. Okay, she never listens to, she never listened to anything that somebody tells her. Miss Murphy did what Miss Murphy wanted to do. If you want more episodes of Paternity Court, make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell. I have not heard sufficient evidence to believe why you wouldn't think you potentially could be this beautiful young man's father. I don't, I, I, I'm, I'm say, waiting for say. the evidence. And you're on a Don't you say hickeys again. Okay, you're on Because <laughs> hickeys don't make babies. <laughs> know what evidence you have that fuels Nothing. your doubt. I never said that it wasn't a possibility he couldn't be my child. What I said was this, I wanted to make sure, because a mouth can tell you anything and she can sell stories quick. So the, I wanted to know for myself if that was my child. I don't see none of the features on him of me. And I it's don't. taking you three years? I don't see none of the it's features It's taking you three years see, to do that? It, it wasn't about the fact of trying to put the Those blame years. on her. I've been trying to talk to he you to get like you to you. understand, he like singing to just to like understand you. what's going he on. He cannot sing just like you. I, that's I, well, been, that's, it's I, all I, you. Listen, 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 listen. I'm glad you did take this opportunity Opportunity Me to too. develop and further your testimony because in the beginning you were pretty much saying yes I had sex with her yes the sex was unprotected however there's no way I could be the father of this no, child Your Honor, that's and that just I'm didn't saying. make sense now you have a witness I'd like to hear from her ma'am please stand and step to the podium your name my name is Mrs. Miles Mrs. Miles and you are Mr. Miles's Wife. Wife. Yes. And ma'am, yes. how long have you been together? About four years. For four years. Almost oh, four years. wow. And my son is three. Come yes. on now. And the child <laughs> is three years. She was I nowhere said. in the picture. <laughs> I went over there every, almost every day. Whoa, she was nowhere in the picture. I nowhere. Said almost four years. Almost four years. He's almost. not even almost four yet. She, yes. I know, no, I know, I know nothing about Tanisha or Tequari at all. Right. I found out we got together in 2012. I found out in 2013. And so when and you so, found out, that was just a year ago that right, you found out. Right. Do you want to watch Paternity Court on TV? Go to paternitycourt.tv to find your local listings. If Miff Murphy would have thought that I was her son, Kiva would have told me before we even got together. Not necessarily. Like, how is that? Not is that no. Like, I, like he told me, like he told me about his other baby mamas. I know about them before we got together. But I've been barely falling down. I know about them before we got together, too. Is this too. an issue? Do you take issue with Ms. Murphy because of this or be with your husband? Kind of both. Both. Okay. Because I feel like, I feel like, exactly. as her being a woman, I feel like she should have came to me, not the other baby mama saying that my husband's a day be dad. No, 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 no. I never said he was a Debbie. I never said he was a Debbie. Never said he was a Debbie. What responsibility never. does she have to come to you to tell you that exactly? Her you're you're with his father. You're with his father. You should have came to me and said, "This is his son. If it is his, I want him to get in his life. I want him to get his know his brothers." Oh, wait a okay, minute, but then Murphy, hold, hold on, him hold on, so hold that you can on. be around him. Wait, just like I, his no, Miss Murphy, hold on. You're saying she should have come to you. Honestly, you're right. I feel that if she's with his father, you, she, if he get, if he sees him, 
he, she's going to be there. She's going to have to get around him. So in order to eliminate <coughs> all the problems, I felt like if if that's if she's saying how she really felt, she would have came and been like, you know what? We need to see if this baby is his. He needs to meet his brothers and sisters. Look, look, and look, look. I, I am all, all look, look, look. I, I am I all about. Let going. me have a statement in this courtroom. <laughs> Order but, in the court. I'm trying to tell you all. You all are way off the path to something constructive. Everything is leading us in the wrong direction and when we should be leading to trying to find some type of answer, peace, and a positive future for Takori. May I say something? No! Okay. <laughs> he has to be honest with his wife about the situations he's involved in when they meet and marry. Whether or not the paternity had been established, he still has to be honest and say, I potentially have an issue in my life mm -hmm. that involves a paternity suit, and I, I, I may have to deal with this. Likewise, it is not Ms. Miles' responsibility to You're come right. to you and try to create a co-parenting situation between her husband and you. Right. You all need to get that. Now, another man is raising to Corey as his own. Yes, and I have... And that's your witness. Yes. Sir, I would love to hear from you. And we, we have... He has such... He has such a good relationship with this man. I provided videos and everything to see how much a father he's been to this boy. Sir, state your name. My name is Mitchell Narbias. Thank you for being here. Uh, Mr. Narbias, please explain the nature of your relationship with Takori. Well, I've been with Tanisha since Takori was two months. I'm his, I'm his dad, no doubt about it. Like, I'm not biologically, but you know, like, everything this boy there knows, is there. everything he knows, I there. teach him. He got favorite colors. His favorite color is my favorite color. You know, we play games. I taught him his colors. I taught him his numbers, his ABCs. Teach him, taught him everything that he knows. You know, like, when he wake up, when he wake up in the morning, the first thing he do, he wake me up. Daddy, I'm hungry. Daddy, I love you. Good morning, Daddy. When he's hurt, he don't go to mommy. He goes to no, daddy. daddy. When I go to work, he cries, even though his mom is there. Mm -hmm. To be honestly truthful, it don't matter to me if he was the father or not, because I'm the dad. I've been there. I'm going to be there, no matter what happens. Truly speaking. I've been here. I gave, I gave if, if Kiba was the father, I gave Kiba chances to be there for Takori, and he didn't take them. When you say you gave him chances, what what did you do to reach out to him? Um, I, I told him he can come and see Takori. I didn't care, you know. I let them go outside, have 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 fun time, have father son time. Let them do, you know what I mean? Like, be a part of your son's life. You know what I mean? That's what I let him do. But he keeps coming. In, he keeps coming in and out. One you minute it's his see? son, the next minute it's not. Mr. Miles, as you look at those pictures of another man with a son that could potentially be yours. Well, Your Honor, honest opinion, that's fine and dandy that he is doing those things. That's great he is doing those things. you won't. I never... No, it's not the fact that I won't. It's the fact, like I said beforehand, when a relative tells me that she's dealing with other people, that gives me... That gives me wonders to wonder whether that's my child or not. However, I'm not here to argue or try to make a fool out of nobody. I'm here to find out if Takori is my son. And if Takori is my son, then it doesn't matter what she does or what he does, I'm gonna be in my son's life. As simple as that. We'll see. And, 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 and nobody is trying to nobody is trying to take away from you being a father figure inside of his life. I put it like this: due to the fact the whole time that we've been knowing each other, it's always been disrespect between her, calling me at my name, all kind of stuff. So we never had a good relationship type to be able to talk to her and stuff like that. Whether he's inside of that that child uh, to Corey's life or not. You know, after I find out if it's my son or not, I would never pry that away if you gained a relationship with him, but I'm gonna do my part as a dad and do what I need to do. Good. But in the, That's but in exactly the same... exactly what I needed to but hear. But in the same sense, now, Judge... Now, Ms. Murphy, if he is the biological father, he's just stated that he wants to step up and he wants to do what he should do for his son. And I'm perfectly What if he that. is not? I don't... There's no way that he couldn't be. No way. No way. He was dealing with people. Okay, what'd you say? It's all Jerome, right. I'm ready for the results.
These results were prepared by DNA Diagnostics and they read as follows. In the case of Murphy v. Miles, as it pertains to the paternity of three-year-old to Corey Murphy, Mr. Kiba Miles, you are his father. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I have no reason to lie. I have no reason to lie. No reason. No reason. That is such a relief because I've been raising my son by myself for three years and it's hard. Not by yourself. It is hard. Not by myself, but by myself. You know what I'm saying? He yes, don't have I to do. do nothing if he don't want to do it. But I've been doing this by myself. So I don't so have nobody father, to call. So as a father, let's work together. All this arguing, all this disrespect that you do be doing. He let's does. listen. Your let's Honor. minimize. Your Honor. Let's listen. Be quiet. Listen. Your Honor. Let's, okay. you know, exactly. Um, I'm so happy to Corey at least now knows who his father yes. is. You know, it's it's. I don't know, I'm, I'm starting to tune you all out because it's just, it's becoming heads yapping. And the DNA results are in. You two are parents, but he also has step parents. You all are his village, but you're burning it down. You can begin again today for this beautiful child's sake. The court has resources for you. We're gonna help you begin to go through this process. Take advantage of it. Take it seriously. Step outside of yourself and, my baby and decide what's best for the child. I wish you the best of luck. Court is adjourned. When I heard the results, I felt relieved. I felt happy. It's been three years. My son deserves to know who his father is. You know, so now he knows that that's his father. When I'm his daddy, I've been there for him and I'm not going to go anywhere. Well, knowing now that uh, Chakori is my son, it's my responsibility to be a father to him and to show him a different life.